A retired senior police officer, I believe from Avon Somerset Police, has been found guilty of assaulting two young girls. The claims are historic in that they are said to have happened decades ago, but I've not been able to find more specific dates, which could indicate if he was still a serving cop at the time, but he is said to have improperly touched the victims, but again, not a great deal of information on what he actually did. John Marsh denied any wrongdoing, but he was found guilty of two indecent assaults by a jury and he was sentenced yesterday, December the 9th. Judge Julian Lambert, sitting at Bristol Crown Court, sentenced the now 89-year-old to 12 months in jail. Suspended for two years, ordered to pay both victims £5,000, handed 40 re... Handed 40 rehabilitation days and put on tag for two months for twelve. Handed 40 rehabilitation days and put on tag for 12 months, meaning that he can't leave his property between 9 p.m. and 6 a.m. The system's a joke. I was on tag for growing some weed and I wasn't allowed out after 7 p.m. or before 8 a.m. So I was on house arrest for more hours of the day than a convicted molester. The judge added, the tag will mark the seriousness of what you did. You will be reminded every day for 12 months of what you have done. The seriousness of what you did, John Marsh, while people who grew a bit of weed get locked down on house arrest for longer than someone who's indecently assaulted young girls. Robert Morgan Jones, defending Marsh, said his client had not offended since and was in poor health. Boo hoo. He said the judge's decision amounted to allowing Marsh his liberty for however long he had left or not. Mr Morgan Jones told the court he will comply with any obligation your honour sees fit to impose on him because he would be allowed to keep his liberty. It would be in your power to suspend. Granted, not a serving cop or even one who's recently served but once a plod always a plod as far as I'm concerned. That conditioning doesn't leave you just because you leave the job.